Hey guys, I'm going to show you what a case looks like. I did not get Expedition, but and I, some of the cards are in sleeves. I'm trying to take them out of sleeves because I forgot I should have done a case recap, which I didn't do, but what can you do? Two quarantine field. I guess I'll do the Mythics. Hopefully, yeah, right here. A green Walden of the something something. A Outcast. to part the veil as well as a void the odd dude two undergrowth champions a foil pre-release omoth locus of rage and ogamog yugamog i don't know how to and this is obviously like very out of unorganized uh dust stalker i had them organized and i started making decks on them and then they became unorganized, so I'll try to put them in groups. Mondu, Ambush Leader. He's actually a lot better in playtesting than I felt like he would be. Nanya, <laughs> I'm not gonna say this dude. Uh, Angelic Captain, Veteran War Leader. I know I've got every single card. Phantom Feeder, so I have a playset of those. Uh, I actually have them running in decks, and I cannot find the other two right now, so didn't take them out. Brutal Explosion. Explosion, um, that card is very good. And then March from the Tomb and Bring to Light, so I'll just put it like that. Let's see. Ruinous Path. Okay, Endless One. Endless One is very good for my deck, because I always need to turn on... Liliana and she's very hard to turn on so I just pay for this dude and turn on she becomes uh, Draina, Gideon, um, Planar's Outburst so I guess I'll put them here Ugin's Insight, Exert Influence, a, billion, a bazillion uh, Guardian of Tazrim so out of the intro rares I think we got a play set of each from this case Prism Array Blue was definitely not a color that you're like super excited to see. Drown of Hope. Outcome Halkite. Uh, this Halkite is a very cool ability. I like it. It's just too much. Uh, Serpentine Spike. Bar Barrage Tyrant, which is not bad. Radiant Flame. It probably will see some play, but not in my deck. Um, Akum Firebird. So this is the one that really upset me the most because apparently your chances of pulling a Mythic are similar to pulling a... Uh, Expedition. So I pulled two foil mythics and they both were the same. Like, what are the chances of that? <laughs> so I'll move some of the cards away so you can. Uh, I guess I'll just put the red. I'll put the ones here and I'll move it away. It's just too many cards. Um, gruesome Slaughter. Desolation Twin. Conduit of Ruin. So you, if you buy a case, you get pretty much a place of everything. Align Hedron Network, uh, Blight Herder, Lantern Scout. So my boxes are not, they're still uploading. I don't know. I think Google does not like the fact that I uploaded so much recently. But what can you do? Hero of Goma Fada. So that is for white. Nissa's Renewal. Woodland Wanderer. Hydra, and we'll have all the cards to get one of. This was the card I was most excited to get multiples of, because I need four of him for my Nair deck, but I don't, I didn't get multiples of him. From Beyond, this card is way better than Awakening Zone, and it's cheaper than Awakening Zone, so I'm kind of confused about why that card's very good. I would love one in foil. And of course, we started with a Blood, a Brood Butcher. Why would we not want to end with five of them? Oh, but this is probably, should probably be here. Okay, so green. Oh, black was not bad. Black, um, Painful Truth. Overseer. Wasteland Strug Strangler, which is an interesting card. I, I really wish it didn't have the ingestibility for that card because it would just be so playable in my deck. Abomination. Um, this card is interesting. It does give you gas. It is a very big card. And I don't know, like it might see play. I'm not gonna play in my token deck right now because at four I have Gideon and Sorin and they're so much better. Shrine of the Forsaken Gods. 
So this card, flavor-wise, is amazing. These are actually the Adrazi. Ad the Adrazi used to be human. The gods known for to the merfolk as Yora, Emira, and Kosi were nothing more than false memories of a monstrous trinity. The Adrazi titans Ogamog, Emiko, and Kozilak. Emiko was an angel. Wow. So I said collect more of her. Uh, Sanctum of Ugin, <laughs> a playset. Uh, I got a playset of each of these. Sampling, Vance, uh, Canopy, Vista, Glide, Mars, Prairie Steam, Sunken Hollow, Lumbering Falls, and then the only one I didn't get, of course, was an island. Um, but what can you do? So out of a case, I only opened four of these. I don't know how... Un I assume these would be very common, just like the first Zendikar, but they seem to be... Not that common, which is surprising to be honest. So, okay, we're gonna do FNM Lion and then we will do my new deck tech, and I think that does it for this week. Bye, guys.